Chinese manufacturer BYD has delivered its first batch of 100 EVs to Mexico. Nice. Now, which EV is that? Juan. Juan? Man, they really pandering to the Mexican market, huh? No, 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 not Juan. Juan. <laughs> you ever hear the story of how Chevy failed to sell a car in Mexico? It was the Chevy Nova, which in Spanish, Nova, no go. Oh, Nova. <laughs> anyway, tell me more about Juan. Okay, it's the BYD One Plus. It costs 799,000 pesos or $46,500. Goes zero to 60 in 7.3 seconds. Has a 60 kilowatt hour battery, a range of 298 miles. That's NEDC, so think more like 250. And 80 kilowatt charging speed. Not great. So it's more Leaf than Model Y. Although I'm not so sure Nissan is selling Leafs in Mexico, but used 2021 Leafs sell for nearly the same price. Okay, but a Model Y costs like $47,000. So, I mean, how could the Juan possibly compete? Well, actually, a Model Y in Mexico costs 954,900 pesos. That's $55,600. And wait, that's a rear wheel drive unit. So a rear wheel drive in Mexico costs more than the dual motor in Estados Unidos? Yes, uh, C. So that puts the Juan Plus at a $9,100 price advantage. Hmm. So does the Juan compete in Mexico? I think BYD saw a place that they could compete, and so they moved into that place because they're like, okay, the Juan's really not going to compete in the U.S., but it will compete here in Mexico. And do you think that they're going to change the Y to a J? <laughs> I just think it's great marketing. Everyone named Juan in Mexico is probably going to want. I got a car named after me. <laughs> hey, everybody. Thanks so much for watching. Now, you know, clips. You can watch full episodes of Tesla Time News on Tuesdays and in depth on Fridays. Just click the link down below and head over to the Now, You Know channel.